Hey there, future software engineers, and welcome back to Tech with Hamza. I'm Hamza, your go-to source for all things tech-related. Today, we have an exciting topic for those of you dreaming of becoming a software engineer in Canada. Whether you're a student, a career changer, or an aspiring tech enthusiast, this video is packed with valuable insights on how to kickstart your journey towards a rewarding career in software engineering right here in the Great White North. So, let's get started. Becoming a software engineer in Canada is an exciting and achievable goal, but it requires careful planning and dedication. We'll break down the process into clear steps, so you can chart your path with confidence. Number 1. Education. Choosing the right educational path is crucial when aiming to become a software engineer in Canada. Most aspiring software engineers opt for a bachelor's degree in computer science or software engineering. These programs offer a comprehensive curriculum that covers essential topics such as programming, data structures, algorithms, and software development methodologies. For example, the University of Toronto's computer science program is renowned for its rigorous coursework and strong faculty. Students here not only learn the theoretical foundations but also have access to cutting-edge research opportunities. Another option is the University of Waterloo's co-op program, which integrates work placements with academic studies. Such programs provide students with invaluable hands-on experience in real-world tech environments. Number 2. Master Core Concepts. Mastering core computer science concepts is vital for any aspiring software engineer. These concepts serve as the foundation of your career and help you solve complex problems efficiently. Let's take algorithms as an example. Algorithms are step-by-step -step procedures for solving specific tasks. Understanding and implementing algorithms effectively can significantly enhance your problem-solving skills. Learning different sorting algorithms like quicksort, mergesort, or bubblesort, and understanding when to use them, can be instrumental in real-world applications. Data structures are another critical component. Consider data structures like arrays, linked lists, and trees. Learning how to choose the right data structure for a given problem can drastically improve the performance and efficiency of your software. Number 3. Gain practical experience. Practical experience is where the rubber meets the road in your journey to becoming a software engineer. Internships and co-op programs offer hands-on exposure to the industry and can be a stepping stone to your dream job. Suppose you're studying in Toronto, a tech hub. In that case, you might explore internships at companies like Shopify or RBC, both of which offer valuable work experiences in software development. However, don't underestimate the power of personal projects. Building your own software applications or contributing to open source projects not only hones your skills but also demonstrates your passion and commitment to potential employers. For instance, you could create a mobile app that solves a common problem or contribute to a popular open source library like React or TensorFlow. Number 4. Networking. Networking plays a pivotal role in the tech industry. Attending tech meetups, conferences, and online forums can help you make connections that may lead to job opportunities or collaborations on exciting projects. Let's say you attend a local Python meetup in Vancouver. You might meet professionals from companies like Microsoft or Amazon, who could provide valuable insights into the industry and potentially open doors for you. LinkedIn is a powerful platform for networking in the digital age. Building a strong LinkedIn profile, connecting with professionals in your field, and engaging in meaningful conversations can help you establish a strong online presence and connect with industry experts. Remember, your network can be a valuable source of advice, mentorship, and job referrals as you progress in your software engineering career in Canada. Number 5. Polish your resume. Your resume is your first impression on potential employers, so make it shine. Highlight your relevant coursework, technical skills, and any internships or projects you've worked on. Tailor your resume to the specific job you're applying for, emphasizing skills and experiences that align with the position's requirements. For example, if you're applying for a front-end developer role, emphasize your proficiency in web development technologies like HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. Use quantifiable achievements to stand out. Instead of saying you developed a web application, say you built a responsive e-commerce website that increased user engagement by 30%. Number 6. Job Search. When you're ready to embark on your job search, utilize online job portals and company websites to find positions that match your skill set and career goals. For instance, if you're interested in artificial intelligence and machine learning, you might explore opportunities at organizations like NVIDIA or Element AI in Canada. Applying for positions at startups can also be a fantastic way to gain diverse experiences and responsibilities early in your career. 
Don't hesitate to reach out to company recruiters on LinkedIn or via email to express your interest and inquire about job openings. Number 7. Prepare for interviews. Technical interviews are a standard part of the software engineering hiring process. They often include coding challenges and problem-solving exercises. Prepare by practicing coding problems on platforms like LeetCode and HackerRank. Familiarize yourself with common algorithmic questions, data structures, and programming paradigms. For example, you might encounter a question that asks you to implement a binary search tree from scratch. Being well prepared can boost your confidence and performance in interviews. Don't forget the importance of behavioral interviews too, where employers assess your soft skills and teamwork abilities. Share real-life examples of how you've collaborated effectively with colleagues or overcome challenges. Number 8. Continuous Learning. The tech industry is ever-evolving, so it's essential to embrace lifelong learning. Follow industry news, read tech blogs, and consider taking online courses or certifications to stay current. Platforms like Coursera, edX, and Udacity offer a wide range of tech-related courses, from machine learning to cloud computing. For instance, if you want to delve into cybersecurity, you could enroll in courses from institutions like the University of Toronto or the University of British Columbia, both of which offer excellent cybersecurity programs. Number 9. Consider certifications. Certifications can enhance your credibility and open doors to specialized roles. For example, if you're interested in cloud computing, earning an AWS Certified Solutions Architect or Azure Administrator certification can demonstrate your expertise to potential employers. Remember that certifications often require a combination of studying and practical experience. Completing a certification not only adds to your skill set but also boosts your resume's appeal. Number 10. Soft Skills. Soft skills are often the differentiators in job interviews. Effective communication, teamwork, and problem-solving skills are highly prized by employers. For instance, during an interview, you might be asked to describe a situation where you had to work with a team to overcome a challenge. Recall a specific instance where you successfully collaborated with colleagues, navigated disagreements, and achieved a positive outcome. Incorporate these soft skills into your resume and cover letter too. Instead of merely stating you have good communication skills, provide examples of how your communication improved a project's efficiency or helped resolve conflicts. There you have it, a detailed roadmap on how to become a software engineer in Canada. Remember, this journey requires dedication, continuous learning, and resilience. As you pursue your dream career in the dynamic tech industry, never stop seeking opportunities to grow, connect with others, and make a meaningful impact through your work. If you found this video insightful, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with friends and peers who might benefit from this guidance. If you have any questions or want to share your own experiences and insights, feel free to leave a comment below. I love hearing from you. Make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you stay updated with our future content. Check out our playlist on tech career advice for more in-depth insights into the world of tech. Thanks for joining me today, and I'll see you in the next video. Best of luck on your journey to becoming a successful software engineer in Canada.